Trust me, women are really good at strategically putting herself in situations, okay? Like how, right? If she's interested in you, she's gonna find every single way just to be around you, just to be in present. Yo, what up, my young kings? It's your boy out here, back here with another video. So hey, you guys see from the title, I'm gonna give you guys 10 signs she wants the D. She wants that BD energy, all right? So yo, if you guys are new to the channel, I like giving guys dating advice, how to be an overall attractive male, how to be a high value male, how to be an alpha male, and sometimes how to text girls. So you guys like this kind of content, bro, just make sure to hit that like button and make sure to subscribe, because I post videos every Tuesday and Thursday, and I don't miss a day. So, so first way in order to know she actually wants it is like, yo, she's always going to be touching you. Trust me, you know when a girl touching you, bro, because you be just talking and she just be touching you like this. Or like every time you talk to her, she just touch you like this, touch you like this. Like one thing that was taught a lot, like in the pickup community, PUA community, they was like, yo, always try to initiate physical contact with a girl. But now imagine from the reverse way, when she's the one that's actually touching you, that means she's really a touchy-feely person. And girls who are really touchy-feely are usually down with that kind of stuff, okay? So like, yo, those type of girls want you to dig their guts, bro. They want you to, mm, they want you to destroy it down there, okay? So the thing is like, yo, that's the first thing. She always gonna be touching, 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 touching. And then another thing, she gonna ask you like, yo, did you smash Prince O's like button? Say, nah, smash it for the YouTube algorithm. It helps the channel grow. But yo, smash it, okay? But let me jump into my actual second point, all right? Second point, she's gonna ask for you guys to hang out or for her to come over. Cause like, yo, when a girl's actually interested in you, she actually wants to hang out. Like, yo, Tommy Lauren said it herself in her whole rant, right? She said in her rant, like, she doesn't wanna be your texting buddy. She actually wants to hang out. She actually wants you to make plans, right? And so like, a girl will get so frustrated to the point where you're not making plans that she will ask you out herself. And if she asks you out herself, she asks you to hang out, yo, if she's really interested. I don't want you to be in my comments talking about, Yo, bro, she wants the D. That's it's flowers. It's that simple, bro. Like, yo, don't take deal. Don't take these clues as what is. It is what it is. She asked me to hang out. She wants you, bro. Number four, bro. I'm sorry. I had to put this in there, right? It's common sense, right? But it's not common sense to everyone, bro. If she's in your bed, she wants to be, bro. If she's in your bed, she wants to be, okay? Do I have to say it one more time? If she's in your bed, she wants to be, okay? Because literally, bro. I have my I have my Discord chat and I have my Patreon group chat, right? I remember one instant for sure, right? A guy was talking to like, yo, bro, I don't know how to make a move. I don't know if she wants me. She's in my bed. Like, what do I do? She's in my bed. She doesn't, I don't know. She's in my bed. What should I do? What should I do? What should I do? Like, bro, why are you texting us if she's in your bed? Why don't you just make a move? And I can't judge no one for that because I've been in the same situation. I remember one time, like, yo, I was actually really sick. This is like my freshman year in college, right? So my freshman year in college, one of my RAs, he's still one of my close friends. He's still one of my close friends to this day because he's my line brother in my fraternity. And he always brings up, like, yo, bro, I remember this man. Oh, he came down. He was looking fly. He was looking dressed up. He was so happy. He asked me where I was going to. And that's when I was going to a girl's crib, right? So I was going to the dorms. And I went to the dorms. And what ended up happening is, like, yo, we was just chilling. I was in her bed. I was scared to cuddle with her. Like, like we're cuddling like this and my hands are behind my back because I didn't want to touch her. I was scared because I, I just didn't know I was a beta cuck back then, okay? And so like, yo, basically at the end of the day, right? When I was in that situation, do you think I ever heard from her after that day? Nope, never heard from her ever again. Was I ever invited back? Nope, never invited back. And how did I go back to the dorm? Son, I went back and I was sick as hell and he remembers my face. So that's why he brings it up to this day every single time. But basically, the moral of the story is what I'm telling you is like, bro, you have to make the move if she's in your bed. She wants it, bro. I'm trying to tell you this right now. This is kind of controversial, but hey, it's hard to understand. Any guys who, who's alpha understand, if she's always there, if she's always around, she wants you, bro. Trust me, women are really good at strategically putting herself in situations, okay? Like how, right? If she's interested in you, she's gonna find every single way just to be around you, just to be in present. Like, yo, if you're an alpha male, you probably been in this situation, right? You're just chilling at the bar, cooling. You with your friends, right? And all of a sudden, you see a girl, she's just turned around in front of you. I'm like, 
how, 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 how'd you get from over there to, to right here in front of me? Yeah, maybe she doesn't want me. And then you, you move two steps over. Next thing you know, she's talking to her friends in front of you. Like, you, you just went from here to, to there. Like, yes, bro, she wants you, bro. Flat out. Like, but that's how reality really be. Like, yo, if a girl really wants you, she's going to be in your presence. Like, you maybe you be at the library or something like that. And you start seeing that girl pop up in the library. Why is she popping in the library? Or maybe she's always liking your photo or it's always in your DMs, bro. If she's commenting on every story, bro, she probably likes you, bro. Like, flat out, she probably likes you, son. <laughs> like, yo, that means she's always there. She's on, she the first one to come on every story. She's the first one to like your video. She's the first one to watch your story. She's the first one to comment. She's the first one to like Prince O's like button, okay? <laughs> but, yo, that means she's really interested in you, bro. Like, hey, a lot of stuff, girls are good at sub, sub, subliminal hits. Sub, subliminal hits, okay? You guys know what I mean, son, right? They want, they like that little seductiveness, right? They like, like, not throwing it, throwing all the way out there. Like, they put their hand out there, but they don't put it all the way out there. They want you to catch it. You grab it. That's why they won't fully say, like, yo, I want you. They'll just give you little hints and explain you to understand and if you don't understand it's all like guys don't understand why don't they ever understand my head i'm throwing it out there i'm making myself available but they, they just not doing it because girls don't do the full approach they want you to do the full approach but most of the time she will help you out she doesn't react what does that mean okay like hey you'll see when a girl doesn't like you but she will flat out say no like you try to move her hand i literally be in situations like before like when i was young right i would put my hand on a girl like this and she will literally pick it up and move it back there to the other side. Like, okay, like, listen, if a girl's not interested, she will do that. Like, wait, you start rubbing on her or something like that. And she'll, you'll see she's on the other side of the couch like this, moving, 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 right? That's how you know when you get one closer, she's gonna keep moving this way. That's how you know when a girl's not interested. Like, hey, but you realize, like, hey, what I used to do, like, hey, sometimes when I was a color with girls, like, I would, I would start rubbing and stuff like that, right? And then you'll see, like, hey, she doesn't react. She doesn't move. That shows that she's actually interested in you. And, like, yo, when you're going for the kiss, like, hey, you'll find out that most of the time a girl's going to kiss you back. They won't stop you. Like, most of the time, a lot of guys are scared to go for the kiss. Most of the time, you find out, like, yo, girl will accept your advances. And that means she's interested. That means she actually wants you, okay? She acts very feminine around you and submissive. What does this mean, right? Yo, it's 2020 at the time of filming this video. You guys are probably going to be watching it all the way to 2021, okay? Because that's coming around the corner, okay? The thing is, like, yo, feminism is a big thing, right? A lot of girls want to be masculine. They want to fit the traditional gender role of a man, okay? They want to be, they, they want to have, I don't know, feminism, okay? They want to be more masculine, okay? That's how it is, right? When a girl traditionally acts feminine around you, like when she starts cooking for you or starts trying to help you or starts trying to please you, that's a sign that she's interested because she's in her natural feminine state and that means she's really interested in you, okay? She gets really close to you, okay? Like, yo, a girl's interested is gonna continually try and get closer and closer to you because they wanna be around you. Like, hey, she might start hugging you randomly or she might just be in your presence or she might come closer like this, like this. You'll see her come closer to you and you got, you'll notice because like, hey, when someone comes closer, you really actually do notice. And that's a sign that she's interested, okay? One way I always know how to go to kiss, like, when I start going into a girl's bubble, right? And she doesn't move back, she stays there and she stays there and even sometimes she'll come closer to me that's how i know she wants me to kiss her and that's how i know she wants me to make a move so that's a sign like hey if she keeps getting closer to you or she's not even moving back that's a sign that she's interested okay right? but the thing is i want you guys to calibrate everything right if you try to put your hand on her and she moves your hand She's not that interested, bro. If you try to get closer to her and she doesn't get closer to you, bro, she's not that interested in you, son. I'm be real with you. Like some of these signs, like some of them is push, pull, hard to get playing games. But at a certain point, bro, you don't want to play games no more. Just get girls who are actually interested in you for who you are and not girls who are out here playing games, bro. Because ton of guys, like, hey, I get questions asked every single day, right? Like, hey, is this girl actually interested in me? Is she playing games? I feel like I'm getting played, right? If you have to actually feel like that, bro, it's not worth it. Get a girl who's actually interested in you, okay? Like the other day, bro, I'm not gonna lie. I got flaked on a few times, like in the past couple, like I was bad as four dates, I got flaked twice, right? And the last time, right? A girl, she flaked so bad, like, I hit her up, like, yo, let me know when you're away. She never hit me back up. And then the next day, she hit me saying, I forgot. Um, text me another time. I'm going to make it up to you. But I'm at the stage in my life, like, bro, if a girl forgot that she had a date with me or she's really not showing that she's really, really interested, high interested in me, like, yo, I don't want that. 
I don't want girls who play games. You want girls who actually want you for who you are. And that's how you have a happy relationship. That's how you have a sustainable relationship. Like guys constantly ask me like, yo, how do I keep my girlfriend interested? Bro, you keep your girl interested by finding a girl who actually likes you for who you are, who actually is choosing you. You're not the one doing the chasing, she's chasing you. That's how you get interest girls interested in you. Okay. The next point is, bro, she's actively trying to get to know you, okay? So one strategy that I do do a lot is like, hey, when I first meet a girl, I like to get to know them first, okay? Like, hey, I like make them sure they talk about themselves forever, right? Because one thing is, right, I always say in my videos, when they talk about themselves, that's the best conversation to them. But suddenly the conversation is interesting and fun to them, right? So I always come to ask questions like, where are you from? What you doing? Like, kind of get her to elaborate. Oh, so you do that for work? What means you do that? What school do you go to? Blah, blah, blah. Get them to talk about themselves more and more. And so I rarely ever talk about myself unless they ask me, okay? And then I kind of keep it brief, so I keep on getting the conversation back to them, so they do majority of talking, right? So one thing you find out is like, girl, if she's really interested, like, no, I want to hear more about you, okay? Like, tell me more about yourself. She start asking you more about you. That's a sign she's interested, because trust me, a lot of girls can ramble on about themselves all day and not even ask you a single question about you, okay? Not even get to know you. Like, trust me, I none of you, none of you guys have been on more dates to me. I'm trying to tell you, I've been on holidays right and i see some girls will be so shallow with they're really not interested in them. they're really not gonna try to get to know you okay and she'll be on her phone the whole time right that's a sign that she's not interested she probably doesn't want you okay okay the next point is like hey she keeps on in including you into her future like what does that mean like hey she'll be like yo oh my god we should go here oh my god we should do this oh my god yo i like i'm not gonna lie like Yo, she would love you or introduce you to other people, right? This is a sign that she really likes you or like, oh, she's talking about you guys being boyfriend and girlfriend or you guys doing stuff, insinuating stuff for the future. This is a sign that she's interested, okay? And hey, you wanna play all these signs for what it is, okay? Like, hey, one sign isn't like she's fully interested, but when she does a bunch of these, this means she's choosing you. These are all choosing signals, bro. You see her all the time, she's looking at you, That's she's interested, she's touching herself, she's interested, okay? Like you find out like, yo, if a girl's touching you like right here, like touching her face right here, or like pulling her hair, this is a sign that she's really interested. This is a sign that she really wants you, right? But the opposite goes, if you see her playing with her like fingernails, or like playing with her bracelets, or like tapping her fingers, this is a sign, tapping her tails, like her legs, like going up and down. Like you guys know what I'm talking about. You can't really see my legs, right? This is a sign that she's really not that interested, okay? So yo guys, I'm done rapping, right? If you guys like this kind of content, do me a favor. Make sure to hit that like button and make sure to subscribe because I post videos every Tuesday and Thursday. And yo, make sure to check out my Patreon. My Patreon is where I post exclusive content that I don't post on YouTube. So yo, check that out and make sure to check out the recipe. That's my online course where I teach you guys how to approach girls, how to live an attractive lifestyle, how to get that girl of your dreams. So make sure to check out that recipe. So yo guys, I freaking love you and I'm out.